Welcome back to Sunny Photography. My name is Mark, and we're gonna learn how to fix this coming right up. All right, so we're gonna make this quick. Um, come down to effects, and I'm gonna recreate this warp stabilizer requires clip dimensions to match sequence. Fix by nesting. All right, so we're gonna come down here, and we're gonna type in warp. We got warp stabilizer, and I'm gonna drop it down on the clip. And since this clip doesn't match the required dimensions, it's yelling about it. And it says, hey, fix by nesting. This is really easy. We're gonna right click the clip, and we're gonna hit nest. We're, I'm just gonna keep it the same. You can name it whatever it wants. You can see it, it named the clip down here nested sequence 06. And now, when we try, when we try to apply warp stabilizer, Boom, now we're analyzing. Actually, really quick here, every once in a while, I'm gonna back this up, this warp stabilizer will stay here, so I'm gonna kinda of back it up so that that red guy's not there anymore. I've actually exported clips with that, that warning still on there. We're gonna go ahead and nest the clip beforehand. So now it's nested, now we're gonna do warp stabilizer. And now you can kind of see in the background, it's not there anymore. We're going to come up to effects controls. And you can come down to warp stabilizer. And you can see it analyzing the clip. And it gives you a percentage and how many frames it has to go. If there are any other videos you'd like to see about Premiere Pro, please put it in the comments below. If you like this video and you would like to see more, please subscribe. Hit the notification button. And I'll see you on the next video.